It's a Countside Photoshop Tennis, brought to you by Boxing Clever. What is it, you ask? Account Side Photoshop Tennis is a fun and educational game for the account persons in your life. In three action-packed rounds, two competitors from the account department take turns adding to a Photoshop image, with the winner being judged by whose hits are best. Don't be frightened. This video tutorial will breeze you through the basic commands that you use to make your image. Let's begin, unless you have some spreadsheet thing you've got to do, in which case we'll all sit here and wait patiently. No? Fantastic then. First, look at your computer. Nice one. Go to your dock and find the program Adobe Photoshop. It's a blue square with peas on it. Not peas. Not those kind of peas. Now click it open. Next, you need to open a new document. Use your cursor to select File, New. You'll get a dialog box. Under File Size, you enter 1024 by 768 pixels at 72 dpi. I made a ham that way once. This will bring up a blank box, which is like a blank canvas. You'll make your masterpiece of art here. Pretend you're Picasso or Van Gogh. You need a picture. First, we suggest maybe going to your favorite search engine. Search for anything that could be constituted as a background, like field or tennis court. Choose images and all the pretty pictures appear. Click on your very favorite one. Right-click on the image that comes up and select Copy. Now go back to Photoshop and on your menu bar, select Edit and Paste. Now let's put something on that image. Go to your favorite search engine and type in, oh, I don't know, how about Manatee. Find your very favorite aquatic water dweller and then click on the thumbnail. Now right-click the picture and select Copy. Now cyberspace is holding the manatee out there, floating around in limbo and waiting for you to put it somewhere. Go back to Photoshop and select Edit, then Paste. Your manatee appears. And uh, how many of us have ever been at a dinner party where a thing like that happens accidentally? Herb, you forgot to zip. Your manatee has appeared. You are now in another layer. Layers allow you to move stuff backwards and forwards in order. And you can keep all your shizzle on any layer separately, so you can adjust the order later. Look at you, you're becoming shizzle savvy. I see this manatee is on a white background. Select the white area with a magic wand tool. You'll see the edges moving and shaking. This means something selected. Command Shift I will make the manatee selected. Now cut. Well, it's not a very creative serve if you just slap a manatee on a tennis court, now is it? Put some more crap on there. Why, look, he wants a hat. He needs a hat. Let's show you how to size your hat using the free transform tool. If you need to size the hat, right click and select free transform. Now make it bigger or smaller. Nice. He's on a tennis court, right? Get him a tennis ball, Captain Oblivious. Paste it center on the canvas and move it into place. It seems the account person got a phone call from a client. Please enjoy the hold music from the indie rock band, Bunny Grunt. Welcome back. Aren't they nice? They're enjoyable, those bunny grunt fellows. Daddy loves the bunny grunt. It's time to add some type. On your toolbar, select the type tool. It's called the type tool. Wow, that's convenient because it's used to make type. Let's say Helvetica, just for the Helvetica of it. Ah, that's good stuff. Nice work. Type the words Advantage Manatee because it's obvious he has the advantage on this court. I mean, come on, look at the hat. If you ever need help, 
you can ask the friendly art director. Uh, it appears he's a bit busy. <clears throat> Let's move on. Now's a good time to save your document because it looks fabulous. That's not a word I throw around lightly. It's time to send your layered PSD or Photoshop document to your friend for their round. If they need help, send them this video. www.accountsidephotoshop.com Creamy, delicious, and always there for you, TV friend.